Pretty, pretty awesome, right? It's completely free, no need for any third-party apps, and this is completely built into it. It's wireless as well. So, yeah, let's dive right into it. Hey, what is going on, everybody? I'm Riz, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can connect your phone or your Android phone, any phone, by the way, to your TV. Completely free, no need for any third-party apps or anything like that. So, yeah, and it's wirelessly, too. Let's dive right into it. All right, so the first thing you want to do on your Android phone or any Android phone is to go to the settings by swiping down and click on the settings tab. There you go, you are in the settings. Now what you want to do is to go to the Wi-Fi settings. Once you're in the Wi-Fi settings, make sure you are, your phone is connected to the Wi-Fi. But let's say if you don't have Wi-Fi, that's completely okay. Go back into the settings, go to the connection and sharing settings and connect your phone to the available hotspot. By the way, be careful, this is not free. Depending on your network, this will cost you. This needs mobile data, so just be careful. All right, for the sake of this tutorial, I'm going to be using the Wi-Fi. So just go back to the Wi-Fi settings and connect your phone to the available nearby Wi-Fi. As you can see, mine is connected to my Wi-Fi right now. That's it. That's all we need to do on the phone. Now let's jump back to the TV. Okay, so the first thing you want to do on your TV is go to the TV settings. By going into the TV settings, you have multiple options. As I said before, if you don't have Wi-Fi, you can also use mobile hotspot. So go to the network settings and connect your TV to the network or, or the hotspot. In this case, this is my Wi-Fi and my TV is connected to it. Once everything is connected, that's pretty much all we need to do. No need to open anything or any third party apps, okay? All right, now let's jump back to the phone. Okay, on your phone, as I said before, go to the settings by swiping down and go to the settings tab. All right, once you're in the settings tab and make sure, you're, uh, make sure your Android phone is connected to the either hotspot or the Wi-Fi and make sure it's the same Wi-Fi as your TV is connected to. Okay, once you're in the settings, go to the connection and sharing settings. By the way, all the settings are different for different uh, brand of phones, so it should be similar or you can search for it. Okay, so inside the connection and sharing settings, you have cast and if you go all the way down, you have wireless display. Both works the same way, but cast is more like a, um, it doesn't, uh, I don't know, I don't know, okay. So just go to the wireless display and once you're in the wireless display, it should show you all the TVs in the background. In this case, I have my RIS TCL, as you can see. This is the TV that, that is running in the background. So, since they are connected to the same connection, that's why it's showing up in here, okay? So just click on it, and it will, it will ask you for permissions. Just click Start Now, and there you go. In the background, it's connected. Pretty awesome, right? It's pretty smooth, no, no need for any third party apps. It just, it works, so awesome. You can play games if you want to, you can, uh, you can do everything, you can do literally anything you like. If I open the camera, if I open the camera, it's gonna open the camera as you can see. Pretty, pretty awesome, right? And uh, you can play games if you want to. You have multiple options, you have a lot of options to be honest. So, how do I stop this? Hold on. As I said before, you have a lot of options. All right, to stop this, it's pretty, pretty simple. Just go back to the settings tab, go back to the wireless, the connection and sharing settings, go back to, go all the way down to the wireless display. And as you can see, my TV is connected, just click on it. Once you click on it, it should give you the option to disconnect. So just click disconnect, and that's pretty much it. Pretty, pretty awesome, right? Yeah, let me know what do you think about the tutorial in the comment section below. And if you have any questions, do let me know in the comment section below as well. Well, I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. I hope you will like the tutorial. And if you have any questions, do let me know in the comment section below. I will definitely get back to you.